Welcome back to RCR Wireless News. I'm Martha DeGrasse, and I'm here now with Ronnie Haroldsvik. He is Chief Marketing Officer at Spider Cloud. And you had some big news today, Ronnie, with Verizon. Can you tell us about it? Yes, uh, thank you, Martha. Good to see you again. Uh, yes, we made an announcement that we are to supply uh, Verizon Wireless with uh, scalable, scalable small cell systems, and I'm um, quite pleased with that, of course. It's a lot of work that's gone into you know, making that happen, and um, very happy that uh, you know, Verizon has you know, gone ahead and uh, let us go ahead and also announce that and uh, make that be known. So uh, now the hard work starts. Now before this, your biggest customer, I think, was Vodafone. What have you learned from those deployments? Yes, we've been working with Vodafone for three years now, and you know, with scalable 3G systems. And uh, a lot of work went into that, especially in the metropolitan uh, UK and uh, London area. But also subsequently into, you know, with Vodafone Netherlands, also in Netherlands, and uh, in the metropolitan areas there. Um, we have learned a lot just from the uh, point of, you know, also what it takes to operationalize this inside of a mobile operator. Uh, but also, you know, what helps get this out faster and uh, get this deployed easier inside of an enterprise environment. Something that we think, you know, other new entrants coming into this market is going to learn the hard way. Okay, great. And what can we look for next? You're going to hear, hear probably more announcements, uh, more operators getting behind our easy to deploy scalable small cell system, which easily deploys over an Ethernet LAN. Um, I think we're going to hear more support from you know the ecosystem uh, that's going to be working with us. We're going to continue to innovate, of course, and make more product announcements. With Mobile Congress just a few months away, um, we can expect more announcements coming out of us, um, the ecosystem in general, I think. So um, just stay tuned. Okay, great. Now, now, one of your elements is your small cell controller. How many small cells can you support with one controller? Yeah, so we, in our system, you know, we can scale up to about a you know, million and a half square feet and support a hundred sectors with uh, our services node. Um, what's unique about what we have is that, you know, we can support each one of our radio nodes can speak dual band. So you can actually connect 3G and 4G, you know, users simultaneously on that same radio node, and, um, which is deployed then over Ethernet. And then of course, you know, with the announcement that we made today with Verizon, that is a 4G, 4G dual band system, which means you can support anywhere between, you know, sometimes anywhere between 8,000 to 10,000 users, all depending on the configuration of that system. So, you know, there's an enormous amount of, of, um, of scale you know, and the uh, your capacity that comes along with that system being deployed. When you think about, you could have 150 meg um, per radio node, and of course, with uh, the ability to software upgrade these radio nodes, you have the ability also to, with uh, uh, you know, the, uh, and also increase that capacity. You know, as more software enhancements come along and so forth. And I can't necessarily explain, you know, when that's going to, you know, happen. But you know, Mobile World Congress is a natural next step when we make those product announcements. So um, just having flexibility in a system, that's the key thing. Being able to deploy more radio nodes as you need it, being able to software upgrade it without ripping and replacing these radio nodes, and being able to have a system that can be easily deployed without expert help. You know, you don't need, you're not uh, in essence uh, constricted with the bending rules of a wire or, or you know, being uh, restricted by, say, the, the CIPRI, or CAT7, and things like that. So that's kind of the, what's unique about our system that we bring to the table. Okay, great. And then finally, can you talk a little bit about the whole inside-out concept? You've talked to me about that in the past, and uh, I, I think your perspective is an interesting one. Well, I think Spider Cloud has kind of perfected the inside out concept. You know, we have been maniacally focused on the enterprise space, uh, selling it to the mobile operators. And um, from the beginning, from our founders of the company, and we put this up on a whiteboard, as you and I talked about earlier, you know, don't mess with the macro. Uh, that means that you have to have a system that can scale and not interfere with each other, but you also have to have a system that doesn't interfere with the outside macro. So you don't necessarily want to bleed out into the macro cellular network. You want to stay as confined as possible to the space that you have and reuse the spectrum that you have inside the buildings, the venues, and that space. Uh, so, you know, self-organizing, self-optimizing mechanisms is inherently important for that, and that's intrinsic in our system. And um, that's also what, you know, makes the system work. But the, the key here is don't, don't mess with a very finely tuned outside macro network, but work with it. 
All right, good, good information from Ronnie Haraldsvik, Chief Marketing Officer at SpiderCloud. Thank you very much. Uh, you're welcome. Thank you, Martha.